So my first question for you is, what type of film is this, and what's the feel of it? I don't know. You tell me. I, I, if I were the person whose job it was to pitch the idea of a film, no film would get made. But you're a producer. I don't have to pitch it. <laughs> um, uh, this film, you know, it's, it's rare that you get a real... Um, I don't want to say epic, but it does create an epic feeling within the viewer because you realize that so much more is possible within yourself or other people than you ever thought. True stories hit people like that when they're executed well, and you have that balance. And you need the dark side mixed with the uplifting story side to pull that off. And um, it's not so much about football as it is about family and what that means and and once you have your family it might not look what everyone else wants it to look like but it's yours you need to protect it I don't think people protect their family enough and um, I think that's that's y your best family comes in the most unlikely of shapes and colors now I want to ask you I was with Tim's wife actually a couple of days ago and mm -hmm. she was telling me that during football season like all hell breaks loose at their house and yeah. like they're in Tennessee and like everyone goes nuts yeah. So in your house, do you and your husband, are you big football freaks? My husband was a big football player. I knew nothing about the sport, even though I was a cheerleader. Very sad. Um, I had a, such a, a tremendous amount of respect and um, understanding now of what it takes to be a professional athlete that I didn't have before, mentally and physically and emotionally. I, I, I had no idea. Um, and then the coaches that really become the parents. Uh, to so many and basically save lives. So um, I, I fell in love with it that way because I, I had no idea. You know, but you know, unless you've really been trained as an athlete and then put to the test and then have to work as a team player and have to deal with the media, which is insane, and injuries and life and family, uh, you have no idea. No idea. So you're not allowed to sit on a couch all fat with your beer and complain that your players are doing what you want them to do unless you can do that yourself. I think you need to just be quiet. What was it about Michael that you think Leanne saw in him? Why did she decide to, you know, bring him in? It goes both ways. What did Michael see in Leanne that said, okay, I'm going to trust these people, you know? Um, he worked his ass off. He had to commit to getting the education, catching up in such a short period of time. Physically catching up, emotionally catching up, and then trusting this family. Um, both of them, um, that is her kid. And as she said, finally, I have a child that actually cleans up and folds his clothes in his room um, because her other two kids don't. And they admittedly have told me, oh, we don't pick up anything. But Michael is fastidious and neat. So and to see the three of them, the siblings together, you just go, oh, there's the final child. You know, it, you don't think they don't look the same. You just go, oh, there's the final piece of the puzzle that was just never, they didn't know it was missing. But until it showed up, they, they realized, oh, it now feels complete. And last question. Um, what is it that you think, because Leanne has so much moxie, and oh. you yourself got a lot of moxie. I have no moxie compared to Leanne Tui. I am a slug compared to Leanne Tui, and I will admit, I bow down to Leanne Tui. Uh, she scares me, and she inspires me. And um, uh, I don't, she had such an interesting upbringing, and she's so unafraid to barrel through, and she doesn't care who she insults along the way. She doesn't care what bridges she burned because she has an objective, and she's going to get it done, and she can get it done. If you want, you want Leanne Tui on your team. You don't want her on the opposing team. You have to get her on your team, and your life will be, you'll get accomplished whatever it is you want to get accomplished, but you do not want to cross Leanne, and she is a, a, a person who will fight for her family in a way that we could all learn from. Thank you. Thank you.